rub it in and you know, get them used to the system and how to play. How has your role changed? You know, last year just kind of learning the way, and now this year, you know, you're kind of relied on as one of the older guys. Yeah, you know, just being more of a leader, you know, helping guys out. You know, now I know where I'm supposed to be, you know, a lot of things, how things go. So, you know, helping them off the court, on the court, you know, when it comes to like weights and just everything, everything, the whole package, you know, just trying to be a leader. What did Gary and Jawan kind of leave for you a, a lasting imprint on, on not only you as a basketball player, but as a person? Yeah, you know, them guys did a good job here. You know, um, they worked for everything they had, you know, four good years. So, you know, we learned a lot from them. You know, they did a good job leading us and leaving us this program in the right foot, you know, the way we finished last year. So, they did a good job. How has the, uh, the install of the press gone with those younger guys? You know, they're getting it. You know, we got um, a lot of young athletes, so they like to run and, and it fits our style very well. So, um, you know, as long as they're just playing hard and take it day by day, we'll be fine. Any of them having trouble picking it up? No, it's not. It's just, it's just effort. It's an effort thing. So as long as you're playing hard, you know, the, the mistakes are they'll, 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 they'll still like, just play hard. How does the way last year ended kind of fuel this team? Does it does it, does it still fuel you guys to this day? Yeah, you know, it fueled us when the season was over last year. You know, everybody was ready for the next year. But, you know, you got to take it day by day. You know, you want to get better every day. And, you know, like I said, we'll be freshmen so we can be a better group you know, as a whole. Being able to make that run in the tournament, um, can you really put a value on what that what that does for this team? You know, it gives us a lot of experience. You know, um, coming from the tournament, you know, um, come back this year. You know, we're looking forward to doing that and maybe better. You know, or definitely better. So, um, you know, it was a great experience for us to play there. I'm assuming you learned a little bit about playing hard last year too. Every time you take a step up in competition, can you kind of walk me through? The aha moment you might have had last uh, preseason about um, getting in gear. You know, if you if you want to play for, for a coach like this and a program like this, you gotta play harder. You're not gonna play, so you really don't have a choice. You, know, you just gotta play hard and you know um, make the best of the time while you're out there and just try to help this team win. Is everybody more invested because they know they're gonna play a lot this year? I mean, I don't know if you guys could be less invested last year because of that. Um, I wouldn't say everybody knows they're gonna play. You know, you gotta work for it. So you know, um, as the day goes on, everybody put their work in. Everybody gets to eat. So you know. As Coach says, you know, it's a piece of cake. If everybody want to eat, you know, everybody got to play hard. Everybody got to play. So if you're not playing, then, you know, take a piece of the next person, I guess. <laughs> how about, you know, the fact that you know you're going to be making a return trip to the Garden this year, how amped up are you for that? I'm excited. You know, it was a, it was a good good welcome home game last year. You know, we got to win. You know, got to play good in front of my family and friends. You know, it was a good experience. First time playing. So I'm looking forward to that. How beneficial are these extra summer practices? Say it again? Beneficial are these extra summer practices? They're real beneficial. You know, last year we started a little later. Now we get a little more bond with each other, you know, practicing, lifting together, doing more and more team activities. So it's, it's good for us. You know, it's not just practice, it's a lot of stuff off the court. You know. What have you been working on individually this summer? You know, just trying to keep my hands off, you know, be smart while I'm on the court, you know, not foul as much, and just, just knock open shots, you know, just do what I got to do to help this team. You go back and watch film of, of fouls and stuff like that to learn from it? Yeah, you know, it's mostly just me being being alert and, you know, being in the stance when I'm on the court, you know, just just being active at all times. You know, when I when I stood up or took a playoff or something, that's when most of the time I got caught slipping or, you know, doing something crazy. So it's just mostly being alert and just being ready to play. See some of you guys have you know made the T-shirts saying Houston, where the Final Four will be this upcoming year. Um, you know, how how sold are you guys on the fact that you know you, you want to make sure you get there this year? You know, um, we, we say it every day when we come in, you know, we're national champs. So that's that's the goal. And that's where that's where it is in Houston. So that's what we're looking forward to being at that time of the year. So that's basically what that's about.